Okay, I'm here with David Waterworth. Uh, David's part of the British Drifting Championship. Uh, can you tell us a little, little bit about what you do in the British Championship and how involved you've been with it? Well, the, the British Drift Championship's uh, relatively new series. It's a uh, feeder on from the Euro Drift that was happening last year. Uh, the BBC is currently on the television now on uh, Sky Sports. And uh, what it is is just uh, a collection of some of the best drivers mm -hmm. uh, in Britain and Europe now. Uh, guys doing the racing as well and uh, just basically a feeder on to the EDC that's quite well recognised in the racing drifting scene. What tracks and courses does the EDC uh, actively involved with? Well, the, the kind of course are mainly uh, kart courses and uh, sort of levels like that although we'll be going to Silverstone this year and uh, the tracks aren't as big as it only uh, uses high horsepower cars but also uh, lower horsepower cars which uh, do quite well in it. And can you tell us how the rules work for the, the British Drifting Championship? I mean, it's not straight line, it's all about going sideways. Yeah, definitely. Uh, the the Drifting uh, uses a section of cor corners where the cars must be sideways as much as possible with as much angle and as much speed. And uh, that's for the amateurs, but also when you, you move into the pro season, you use twin drifting where uh, a car's in the lead and you are a chase car or a lead car and you have to go around the corners as much speed and angle. And if you're a chase car, then you would try and mimic the car that's in the lead. How did you actively get involved in the British drifting? Well, what it was, I uh, looked in a magazine one time ago and seen some adverts for drifting, and uh, last year I uh, competed in it and finished second place in the championship, and uh, just moved on from there really into the pro season. So for people who would like to try and get involved, uh, how do they go about that? Well, the, the website, the bdcchampionship.com, uh, if you look on there and uh, that gives you a load of the list of the drivers and addresses and details on how to take part and acquire your license for practice days and take part in the racing. And where will we see BDC competitions this, this year up in Scotland? Well, uh, May 30, 31st at uh, Norfolk Arena is the, the next current uh, ED, uh, BDC Championship race and also Silverstone the following month. So it's, it's quite getting about the country. And uh, is it likely to take off as big as EDC? Are you looking at it to become as, just as big? Well, the BDC have worked well to establish it quite well, and with getting on Sky Sports 3 um, on Race World, uh, it's looking pretty good, and it is a feeder up to the EDC. So, how well you do in this season equates to how you move up into the EDC and bigger circuits like Donington and again Silverstone, and uh, also Thruxton, maybe. That's great, David. Thanks for talking okay. to us. So we look forward to seeing someone from the British Drifting Championship. Yep. Thanks Thank for you very much. much. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, I'm here with Ash and congratulations on your win for Max Attack, car of the day. How many wins is that you've had now with the car? Uh, five in total now. Five in total. On the pole, uh, in for 50. You've done a lot of work to the car to get it in the condition it is. What drives you to do that to the car? Well, to be honest, we've been working on uh, our business, which is called Performance Autoelectrics in Edinburgh, and we've been doing that for almost two years. And we thought the best way of doing it is publicising your own vehicle right. and bringing the business up by doing what we do best. And obviously this is what we've done and this is what I've got for it. So I'm proud for Performance Autoelectrics and the boys, my brother Shahan, Gareth, Willie, Masoom, and all the rest of the boys. Thank you very much for all this. Thanks, Ashan. Thank Congratulations. You Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Okay, that's Max Power over. And a great day, bad weather, but it didn't dampen spirits. We all hope to see you here again at Crail for Hot Hatch TV. If you've not tuned in before or you want to be Hot Hatch, get here. We'll see you there.